uh, dwell or deal with uh, with uh, uh, either um, conflicts or at least um, indifference. Yes. And indifference in European history was always road to hell. Yeah. So le let's be more active and, and live and act with people for solidarity with those in need. And distinction between ref refugees and migrants, economic migrants, is, is the pr primary uh, departure level. And then, of course, don't forget that there are causes in the Middle East of this inflow sure. into Europe. Sure. Over which we have a limited traction. But we have right. more, more capacity to deal with this than 50 years ago. Yeah. Mari Kivinimi, um, Finland, I know it's, it's not the main subject of the day, but uh, what on earth is going on? How can you be having such a, uh, um, a breakdown about migrants when there are so few? Actually, I live nowadays in Paris and work <laughs> for the OECD, so I'm not so well aware of all the details <laughs> what is happening in, in Finland. But I just want to comment the uh, yeah. discussion and the questions earlier. So if we really want to kind of get grip of this refugee crisis, the only sustainable solution is a global one. Uh, a lot of measures are needed, uh, beginning from solving the crisis in, uh, and conflict in Syria. And we have to be able to help the countries from which people are uh, are leaving uh, in, to develop themselves. So development assistance, kind of these basic things, we have to uh, make sure that we don't forget uh, uh, sure. those measures uh, either. So, uh, and also the burden sharing in, in that sense also the global uh, responsibility uh, from all the countries uh, uh, part is needed. But when it comes to, to Finland, I, I think that uh, it has been um, maybe a, bit, a little bit of surprise that people also want to uh, come to Finland, to a cold, rather dark uh, country. So I think in Finland we really uh, should be happy uh, of that. But to be honest, uh, I think there have uh, arrived uh, much more refugees uh, to Finland compared to uh, uh, earlier years, and it, it really tells us how uh, acute and big uh, this uh, crisis is. Uh, but also, I think, and this is my personal opinion, Finland should uh, bear its share uh, too in, in the global context and, and also uh, in the European one. Thank you for that. Um, while we've been talking, the audience has been voting and you are very divided. Should EU member states be able to refuse to take in their share of refugees as determined by an agreed EU formula for relocation? Yes, they should be able to refuse, say 54% of the audience. No, they shouldn't, say 46%. So almost evenly divided, but uh, clearly um, that sort of... And then the question, should religion uh, and or ethnicity play any role in determining which refugees EU member states accept? That's a clearer vote. 70% say no, but 30% say yes. So thank you for that. Thank you for, your, for being honest and expressing your views. I want to thank all of our panelists for their answers today. And uh, I think it's been a, an enlightening session, but it certainly won't be the last on this subject. Thank you very much.